वेलकम बैक स्टूडेंट्स टू डिफरेंशिएशन फॉर फिजिक्स माय इंट्रोडक्शन यू नो दैट माय नेम इज सार्थक बबेजा एंड माय क्वालिफिकेशन इज एमटेक इन मैकेनिकल इंजीनियरिंग फ्रॉम एनआईटी जलंधर एंड माय गेट स्कोर इन 2017 वाज 609 एंड माय एक्सपीरियंस रिगार्डिंग टीचिंग इन जेडब्ल्यू एंड नीट इज थ्री इयर्स प्लस सो हमने अभी तक कुछ रूल्स डिस्कस किए थे डिफ्रेंशिएशन के और आज हम एक नया रूल पढ़ने जा रहे हैं जिसका नाम है डेरिवेटिव ऑफ अ कांस्टेंट प्रोडक्ट सो देखते हैं ये रूल क्या बोलता है सपोज करो हमें कोई फंक्शन ऐसा दिया है जिसमें कोई कांस्टेंट टर्म भी आ रहा है ठीक है तो डिफ्रेंशिएशन का रूल ये है कि इफ देर इज एनी कॉन्स्टेंट टर्म इन द फंक्शन देन वी हैव टू सेपरेट दिस कॉन्स्टेंट टर्म फ्रॉम द डिफ्रेंशिएशन and then we have to differentiate the rest of the term theek hai to humne yaha kiya ye constant c ko bahar nikal diya aur differentiate y ka kar diya so finally we will get c into dy by dx to chalo isko ek example se samajhte hain suppose karo hame y ki value given hai let's say y is equal to 6x theek hai now you can see that 6 is here a constant term and uh, this is our whole function which is the y now we want to differentiate this function so we will find dy by dx by applying the rule we can get that dy by dx jab hum nikalenge to dekho hum d by dx pure function ka karenge d by dx of you can write 6x now what does the rule says the rule says that if there is any constant term it will came out of the differentiation so finally you will get 6 into d by dx d by dx of x okay 6 into d by dx of x now d by dx of x we will do by applying the power rule here you can see that the power of x is 1 so we will apply the power rule as we have discussed in the previous video a uh, power rule says that if we want to differentiate the term which have any index let's say this is n then its differentiation will be n into x ki power n minus 1 this is the power rule which we have already discussed in our previous video okay those who have not seen first watch the previous video and then continue with this one so you will get 6 into d by dx of x is what see here the value of n is 1 here the value of n is 1 so we will substitute this value in this term so we will get 1 into x ki power 1 minus 1 now you see that x ki power 1 minus 1 means x ki power 0 and we know that this is the rule of mathematics if anything raised to 0 the answer will be 1 the answer of this term will be 1 so our final answer will be 6 so this is the example where we have applied the derivative of a constant product rule which is very important rule in differentiation let us see one more example so that it is more clarified to you suppose we have y is equal to x ki power 7 and we want to differentiate this so first of all we will apply the power rule and the power rule says that we have to calculate dy by dx and our function is y is equal to x ki power 7 theek hai if we want to differentiate this term we are going to apply the power rule which says that dy by dx dy by dx which is equal to n into x ki power n minus 1 so here n is what 7 so your answer will be 7 into x ki power 7 minus 1 this is by applying the power rule which we have already discussed so you will get 7 into x ki power 6 now suppose if you again want to differentiate this term this you will got 7 x ki power 6 now if you again want to differentiate this term if you are again want to differentiate this term let's say suppose you have to again apply the constant derivative rule first let's say you want to again calculate the d by dx of 
सेवन एक्स की पावर सिक्स सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वॉट यू हैव टू डू यू हैव टू सेपरेट दिस कॉन्स्टेंट आउट so you will get d by dx of 7 into d by dx of x ki power 6 now again you have to apply the power rule in this condition 7 is separated by constant derivative rule and here we have to again apply the power rule so by applying the power rule again you get nx n minus 1 which is 6 into x ki power 6 minus 1 Ultimately, you will get six x five. So your answer will be seven into six x five. Likewise, if you again want to differentiate this term, again you have to repeatedly apply the constant derivative rule. First, you have to separate this constant, and then you have to differentiate the remaining function by applying the power rule. Okay. Let us consider one another example. Let's say we have d by dx of three x to the power seven. I know. So we have separated here the constant term three, and we have calculated the d by dx of x to the power seven. So you will get three times dy by dx. Three times dy by dx. Okay. X to the power seven का differentiation जो हमने निकाला था, इसको हमने dy by dx बोला था. देखो यहाँ से dy by dx हमारा क्या आया था? सेवन एक्स की पावर सिक्स तो डी बाई डी एक्स ऑफ एक्स की पावर सेवन को हमने यहाँ पे डी वाई डी एक्स बोला इस एग्जाम्पल में ठीक है तो यहाँ पे हमने डी बाई डी एक्स ऑफ एक्स की पावर सेवन को लिख दिया डी वाई बाई डी एक्स एंड डी वाई बाई डी एक्स का जो वैल्यू हमने निकाला था वो यहाँ से हमने इसमें पुट कर दिया सो वी हैव पुट दिस वैल्यू यू विल गेट सेवन एक्स की पावर सिक्स एंड कॉन्स्टेंट टर्म इज सेपरेटेड आउट देखो कॉन्स्टेंट टर्म हमेशा हम पहले ही सेपरेट कर लेते हैं डिफ्रेंजिएशन साइन के बाहर so finally you will get the answer 21x ki power 6 theek hai to yahan se aapko pata chal gaya ki dono ke combinations kaise hum use karenge hai na how can we use the combination of constant derivative rule as well as the exponent or power rule okay so is tarah se aap is questions ko solve kar sakte hain i hope you are getting this if you have any queries you can comment on the comment box okay thank you